Hello everyone, I'm Watson. In this video, we're going to talk about how to solve the weak signal issue for a wireless access point. Right here in front of me, I have a wireless access point connected here, and you can see this connection is connecting a wireless access point to our PoE switch. This means this wireless access point is PoE enabled, it's currently gaining power and data through the Ethernet cable to power it up and provide data. So when we're around this access point, we can access our network through this access point wirelessly. That's very convenient, right? And for PoE connections, we can imagine this uh, curl of wire back here is 100 meters, which is currently a limitation for a PoE signal transmission. So after 100 meters, we will need more devices to help repeat the signal. So what if we set this wireless access point 100 meters out and when we're around maybe like another 50 meters, we want to access the access point, but the signal is too weak and our internet quality is not that good. What should we do to enhance this signal? Well, changing an access point might cost them very much because a stronger signal transmitter would cost much more. And we can solve this problem with and we can solve this problem with other methods. Right here, I have our fast cabling PoE extender. What's so good about this PoE extender? It can help us repeat the PoE signal for another 100 meters. So when, we're, when we have reached the 100 meter limitation with this wireless access point connection, we can use this PoE extender, replace the wireless access point, and then use another 100 meter ethernet cable and extend the wireless access point further on. So imagine we want to extend this another 50 meters, then we'll get a 50 meter cable and extend it after we use the PoE extender. So if it's not that clear for you, it means before we had the PoE switch, then 100 meters to the wireless access point. But our now new destination is another 50 meters more further on. So we're going to remove the access point and add the PoE extender here. This means once we have connected the PoE extender, we can always go another 50 meters on, another 100 meters on from this end of the PoE extender. And imagine this is a 50 meter Ethernet cable. We can connect it to the extender and then connect the other end to the access point. So in our new location, which is 150 meters on, when we're at connecting to the access point again, it's gonna be like we're just next to it, and then the signal will be at its maximum quality. We can see right now, the access point has been powered on and power and data has been transmitted to it. So right now, this connection is successfully set up. So this method is the much more easier way and if we have to get like a new, a new transmitter, a new wireless access point, it would cost much more and a little bit complicated because the whole new system needs to be set up once more. This is just a basic expanding exper uh, experience. So if you have any more questions, feel free to leave them at the section below. That's pretty much it for this video and I'll thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.